What's going on YouTube? Kevin Moore here, back with another little video. Here's a very, 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 very extremely short video, right? I'm on the phone with a friend. Shout out to you. You actually inspired this video. You actually inspired the, the thing that I'm going to be doing now in regards to this. And I'm just going to, you know, make this, you know, a lot more uh, motivationally friendly, right? So, I'm on the phone and my friend is like, yo, I noticed that you have a very unique skill or a knack for 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 motivating people like i have this ability to communicate whether it's with men or women or children or just people in general i have this ability to communicate sometimes i speak too fast sometimes i speak too slow sometimes i have a stutter sometimes i do all of these things but he said yo kev what you need to do is you need to use your channel and use your platform to motivate people because you have a skill that can be acquired it can be studied it can be learned it can be perfected but you have a skill kevon and your skill is communication so you need to communicate with people daily or weekly or however fucking long you can in order to motivate them and in order to inspire them because he was like after talking to me on the phone that like I made him feel like something within him that he just wanted to get up and just and just go and I'm like yo just don't even think about it just go 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 and I realized wait a minute someone have some people have told me that in the past several times and like am I ignoring something am I ignoring the fact that I have the ability to communicate am I ignoring the fact that I have the ability to motivate am I ignoring the fact that I have a skill and a knack for speaking public speaking um where it's like you need to just get your point across so I think from now on whether I do it on the daily or whether I do it on the weekly I'm going to just get on here speak and then try to perfect and master this craft of public speaking, of, 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 of communication. And I just said of like three, four times, but you guys get it. So let me guys, blah, 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 blah. verbiage, 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 verbiage. Let me know what you guys think. Like, comment, share, subscribe, and let's have a conversation in the comment section below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Kevon Moore. But is, is communication the, 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 a skill that we are lacking in 2020? And will continue to lack generations further if people are afraid to literally speak to people because of technology or because of so many other factors. Are men afraid to talk to women nowadays and meet them in person because of social media and all these different apps? Is it weird to have a conversation in public with just a random stranger? Is it weird to just, to just talk to someone who you don't know at random? Is, are these things weird? Or, or are we not comfortable with, with public speaking? Are we not comfortable with communication? Let's have a conversation about it. You feel me? All the great public speakers, like, uh, or, or people who I have watched and learned from, like Zig Ziglar, Brian Chasey, Tony Robbins, Les Brown, and the list goes on. There's a plethora of people. Are they, or is communication... A skill that they have studied and they have watched and they have mastered to become a greater version of themselves. And is it something that you too can do, that I can do, that you will watch me do? So communication, like, comment, share, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell. Bow! I'm out.